well, this is a treat. This has been a long, long time in, in the waiting, I think, it's fair to say. I've got to thank John. I've got to thank Chris B. Pimbles for allowing us access to this wonderful machine, Pirates of the Caribbean, Collector's Edition, Jersey Jack Pinball. I have waited a long, long time to play on one of these. It's a, it's a relatively rare game. Uh, certainly in the UK, it's, uh, it's, a, it's an expensive game. These don't come up very often, although there is one at the moment. I think Phil is selling one on the forum, pinballinfo.com. He's selling one. If you want to go and check through the archives on that for pinball machines for sale, I'm sure you'll find one on there. But they come up very, very rarely. And um, I, it's, it's a theme that I, I think it's not that it resonates with me particularly, but I, do, I think they did a really good job with the films. I think it's a great license to get. Um, and I'm pretty sure if Jersey Jack were able to produce more, they would do because they would sell and they would sell well. Um, I guess they haven't done so for um, licensing issues. Anyway, you don't want to hear me talk about it. I've never played this game before in my life. Um, I think this one's probably been around for quite a while. So you can see there's even some barnacles that have started to grow uh, on, the, on the lock bar there. It's, I've got to say, it's not as much of a looker as I thought. That's, that's my first impression. I'm talking about the cabinet um, here as much as anything else. Because what you've got, once Spencer's stopped panning around and filming this one, next to it is a Hobbit. Now, the Hobbit, which we'll cover in a separate video, but the Hobbit looks better. Um, if you just... There you go, you see here, it just sort of stands out more than the artwork and the cabinet and whatnot. It just, it just looks better. It's got a better look to it. And in many respects, I think, if we're, we're going to compare apples with apples here, it was the Guns N' Roses was a fantastic looking machine. However, what we certainly do have on here, we've got, um, we've got a ship, a rocking ship. There's another uh, a bow of a ship here. Remember the ship we called the Black Pearl. Um, I don't know, this must be the Black Pearl. It has to be. Um, which looks really good. We've, we've got a, a, treasure, a, a treasure chest, which is easy for me to say, Spencer. Uh, we've got uh, the pop bumpers. A, a pirate. Arr. Is that... Um, I, I, I was going to say who that is. I don't actually know who that is. It's not Jack oh, Sparrow. No, it's not Jack is it, Sparrow. Is it Will Turner? No, it's not. Who is it then? It's I don't know. It's, it, it says mystery, and I think it will remain so. Okay, okay. Because, um, of course, Will Turner, son of Bootstrap Bill. Arr. In, in fact, I may speak like this for the rest of the video. That's not. No, okay, all right. <laughs> uh, so I've never, played, I've never played this game before. Um, one thing I probably should say about this, I've noticed there's a standard twanger. Oh, standard twanger. Let, let's get a close-up of the twanger. Oh. Oh, oh, wow. Lovely twang. Oh, that really did spring back. Nice action. Thank you. Um, I'm, I'm eager to play it. I've never played it before. That's enough talk. Let's start playing it. Select your character. Okay, select your character. Wow. So, on the screen, we've got... Now, I was speaking to Elizabeth John. Elizabeth Swan. Huh? I was speaking to John earlier on, and he said that all of these characters all have different traits. Yes. And they'll help you throughout the game. He's had the game here for a little while, oh. and, and he's got no idea okay. about all of them. I'm yet, just having so. a look through them here. That's Ian McShane. He was good in Sexy Beast. Um, Henry Turner. I don't know. I, I've not seen all the films. Ah, heck, Captain Barbosa. I think. Ah, there, there be monsters. <laughs> I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go with Captain Barbosa because I, I like him. That's Jeffrey Rush. Barbosa. That's what I said. Oh he, look, he didn't mention Jeffrey Rush. Though, he did. He didn't. He didn't specify. Um, that that shit's definitely rocking at the back. That is, yeah. <laughs> if the ships are rocking, don't yeah. come knocking. No, absolutely right. So I'm gonna I'm gonna pull the twang. Huh? There's a ball in the um, in the plunger. I'm waiting for you, my. My lord. I don't know why I said my lord. That's just drained straight down the middle. Rubbish game. That's embarrassing. That's not my fault. Ah, oh, the depths. Oh, blimey! I took my eye off it. Oh, barnacle oh, oh, well, there you go. Come 
compass points to the most valuable shots available. Well, what compass? Oh, this thing spins in the middle. Yes, apparently. It looks like it okay. does. Okay. Oh, oh, I'm, I'm up on the top ship. Ah. Yeah, I'm up on the shop. I like this. Oh, actually, I quite like that. That's cool because it's, it's tilting and tipping. What's going on there? What's happened? Oh, damn it, damn it, damn it. Now, I kind of assume that the ship would only tilt at certain points. It looks like it tilts the whole time. Hit the action button. That's what he said. Ah, I, I didn't even mean to do the ah yet. Yeah. It was just naturally. I'm, I'm, I'm in character so much that when it drained, I did an ah. ah. Barnacles. The action button does many things. The compass display is your guide. So what is the compass display? That's, that can't be this. That's got to be up um, there. It's got to be on the screen. Chris. Oh, compass display. Oh, all right. Film it. Okay, okay. Well, it's such as such, you can see what Spencer's pointing at. Compass display. There's a, there's a compass display here. Okay. I broke the fourth wall there. Okay. All right then. Arse. <laughs> oh, uh. Well, that's... Oh! I was just drained again. Right, OK, I'm, I'm certainly not doing this game justice. Um. Oh, all right, well, I'll tell you what, that's not me. I blame Captain Barbosa uh, for that. Shiver me timber. All right, crank up another one. I will, I will. Right, okay, let's play it. Right, do you know what, do you know what he'll do? Cutler Beckett. Cutler Beckett. Let's see if I can do a little, a little tweak skill shot. Oh yeah, that's got to be a good one. That is a skill shot. Hit the action button. Oh, I've got it up there. Oh, nice little whirlpool. In fact, it's got a similar thing on... Um, on the stern parts of the Caribbean, a little whirlpool thing. Well, we've seen the whirlpool on white water, on, on quite a few games actually, and even, um, even Cactus Canyon. Oh, hold on, there's a flipper up the top. Well, as in a dolphin or a... That's right. I'm seeing a flipper up there, I've just noticed something. Oh, wow! Got Gareth from the offices on there, which is good. It's nice to see him getting out of it. <laughs> it is. Werner, Werner Mog Multiball. Okay, I was actually trying to get it in this section here. Um, do you want to do a little play field pan, get in there, in between yeah. balls and have a little... Um... I won't be able to no, get you don't in. want to do that. I was about to oh, say, okay, I won't okay. be able to get in that no, tight. Ca camera's not big enough. There are a lot of shots on there. I'm just looking around it as you're filming it. Now, John was telling me earlier that there's a cannon fires from this ship. Yeah. And cut fire, it must fire out of there. And there's yeah. a hole in here and it fires that's and right. shoots that ship, which is, I mean, that's pretty cool. If that's not a pinball moment, I don't know what is. See if you can do it. Well, I don't know what to do. Oh, it's in the chest. I locked one in the chest. I like a chest. <laughs> Pardon the expression. Oh, there we go. And again, that's a, another skill shot. Oh, I, I got it in behind the... Um, snuck it in underneath the upper flipper.
okay, so it wasn't green, so I didn't get the ball locked in. Oh, it's, it's naughty. That's a really neat, neat toy, that. Oh, okay, so that's doing something weird at the back. I hope that's that. Yeah, man, you must be getting that on film. That's Captain of the Dust. Oh, Dutchman. Dutchman. Yes, Captain of the Dustman. Yeah, I, I, I refuse to play that mode. Well, okay. Map, map award. Light one. Arr, arr. We both, we both, arr, at the same time then, Spencer. So it's like natural. Did you notice that's the arr and a pirate? The moment someone mentions gold, arr. arr. In fact, any vowel will do. A, E. Oh, oh wow, oh. come on. That's my favorite mystery level. Oh, okay. Action button collects gold. Oh, numpty. I, I hadn't. Well, what can I do? I'm trying to look at the play field. I can't look at the action button as well, can I? And the, the little compass thing. I wonder what you're going to call it then. <laughs> Give me that back. Give me that back. Action button collects gold. Oh no, that's a shame, that's a shame. Okay. Well, that's fun. That's fun, that's, that's a fun game. That's a fun game, I like the shots on it. Um, I didn't have a chance to learn them all. It would have been nice to have, uh, to have got a multi-ball and locked them all in the, in the treasure chest there. I mean, it's one thing they say about Jersey Jacks, isn't it? There's too many multiples. I didn't see one then. So um, maybe that's more of a recent thing since Guns N' Roses or something like that. Do you want to go, Spence? I'd love a go. Right, let's Let take a the camera. Look at this. Okay. Right. Ah. Smile for the camera. The best oh. not. <laughs> yeah, yeah, have, you got the, have you got the reinforced lens in there? Choose your character. Ah. Right, I will go. Go on. I'm going to go for old, um, a warm Oh, market. you're going for Gareth. Yeah. Now apparently to start the modes, you go up past this post up to that area up at the top where the yes. magnet took the ball earlier on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is that what you say about testicles? I think the spe spectacles. Oh, hello. Where's it going to go? Yep, we're up there. So that so is up there. It's locked behind the post. And it's opened up a mode. Oh, I've locked one in the chest. This just, just gets better. Can you hear, don't you? Dare. Yeah, oh, no. I'm trying to lock another one in the chest. Well, it's not lit, it's not lit green, so I don't think you've oh, got okay. locked there. So you've got to obviously earn that ball lock. Oh, that was nice, wasn't it? Can you try and keep it up in the ship longer, please, so I can film it? Okay, I'll, I'll see what I can do. Yeah. No. no. Arr. Oh. Arr. <laughs> Arr. Arr's and O's. It all goes a bit pirate, a bit Arr. quick. 
Skull values are located underneath each movie cannon. Right, okay. Oh, I've got a skill shot. No, no. There you go. Damn. I was, I'm enjoying this. There's the black pearl oh. doing its crazy thing. Crikey, that one looks like me. Oh. Yes. Well, do you, uh, first impressions, Spence. Um, first impressions, it looks a fun game. It does look a fun game. Um, I think it's got real potential. Obviously, you've got to spend a bit of time with it. Yeah. Um, but I, I think, it's certainly, I like this upper play field. Yeah. Um, there seems to be, just having a look at how many shots. We've got one, two, three main shots there, four or five with the targets as well. Actually, six, seven with those targets on the left-hand side. There's a drain down the right-hand side. Oh, eight targets. Nine. Holy cow. Mm. So one, two, three, four, five, six um, switches up there, and apparently you load the cannon through this one here. Okay, and then the cannon fires and out. It fires it across into this hole. So basically, as as the this ship tilts, you've seen the t ship moving. You have to time it so that you can fire the ball out of here straight across this gap, straight into this ship, and that sinks it. Well, that's the theory anyway. Love it. I am. Um, I like it. I think it's got. It's, it's, it makes me want to push the start button again. There you go. Well, it's always a good sign. We're going to have to film something else now, but uh, oh. well, unless we fair, we've, we've got we've got a lot to film. Some nice things to choose from. There we go. And go. So there you go. I'm really, really pleased. Really pleased to to have a go on on Pirates of the Caribbean. There we go. I like that. That's that's cool. Really like that as well. So suspicious. I'm flicking it to see if it's glass. Um, <laughs> barnacles. Um, it has got barnacles. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, limpets. So, what do you think? Well, it seems fun. It seems fun. I'd, I'd, it's there's a lot of pinball machine here. Um, it's a shame it's as rare as it is. I, I got to say. Um, you know, it's, it's it's just one of those games. You you know, you're never going to own one, are you? You know, I think that's that's the thing. Or, You've either got one. You might ha end up with one coming up, but they're they're quite expensive. Massively, yeah. I mean, between fifteen and twenty thousand pounds. Holy moly! Yeah, that is a lot. It's a lot of money. Yeah. Fifteen to twenty thousand pounds. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> so it doesn't matter if one comes up. Well, there's one up as I say. You know, it's, it's just it's um, you know there's some really good pinball machines out there. So I mean, it's it's you know. You, you, again, it's like anything. You've got to have it to learn the rules. And I'm pretty sure, I mean, looking at this, I'm just seeing so many shots as I'm looking mm. at it now. You know, you need to learn what to do to activate the mode. What, what have you got to do to get that ball lock thing going green again? It, it's, it's all that type of stuff. You're not going to see this on location. You're not going to see this in an arcade. So it's, a, it's going to be hard for you to ever really learn it. But it's it's beautiful. And the play field, as I say, I think the, the cabinet and stuff, there's, mm. there's better looking games. Um the, the, as you say, the upper play field on the um, on the upper. Well, I think this must be the upper deck of the Black Pearl. That's what it, what it must be there. Um, I mean, that's it's so beautifully done. Even just look at these little um, little lanterns that are on there. That that's very very nicely done. That that's really nice attention to detail. Little flicker there. Yeah, nice. yeah. Um, I'll, I'll I'll do that to you later if you don't mind. Oh, I've got, I'm trying to talk about the pinball machine yeah, at the moment. You, you, um, it's, I mean, it's, it's nice. It's nicely done. It's, it's. This is what I would expect from a from a Jersey Jack machine. This this attention to detail, lots of stuff on there. Your pinball moments, um, and it's big. It's a wide body. I know they don't. They're not the wide bodies anymore. You've got a little thing about wide body, haven't you? Sorry. You've got a little thing about wide body. I know. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm more I eat, the closer I get to it. To be and there's actually something really nice at the back. I've just noticed as well. It's the stars flickering in the sky. Nice, nice, nice little effects there I, I think it's a good it's I, I would imagine this is a good a good game um and from what i've seen i really enjoyed that that was good fun to shoot definitely makes you want to play more early impressions excellent